Good morning. Good morning. So we are hitting up the waffle iron. We've never been and Michael's leaving today. So we thought we'd do something fun. We're going to breakfast. Oh, you look so cute. I'm excited to try this place. Yeah. Yeah? Have you done? Yeah, cool dude. Okay, so if you can twist a straw, a straw paper thing mm -hmm. and do this and it actually comes undone, there's no knot, it means that somebody that loves you is thinking about you. So we'll see if Terry's thinking about me. She is, there's, see there's no knot. Yeah buddy. She's thinking about me. <laughs> oh, look at those waffles. Mm, I got like Biscoff and strawberry. Look how pretty this is set up. I know, strawberry, what is yours, ham? Ham, eggs, and waffle. Yeah. What do I want to get you a fork? You hungry? I'm gonna try the fork. Okay, hold on. Oh, hold on. Get some strawberries. Yeah, get them. Can you get it? Oh. <laughs> oh. Mom hasn't had any strawberries yet. No, he's stealing them off of my plate. And he doesn't want any of mine, <laughs> which I'm fine. But I'm totally fine not sharing with him. So we are in our garage. We're in our garage cleaning. It's like really cold, actually. It's cold. A woman. No, it's really cold. I have a scarf and gloves on. MJ's hopefully gonna take his nap, and we just need to organize this place. It has like a nice little shelf to put boxes on, and when we moved here, we just kind of threw it all up there and now I'm like, okay, let's like organize and make it look nice and decent. Is there anything else I need to see up there? No, I have everything down. Other than um, our camping stuff. A few moments later. Okay, I feel like the garage is more organized. The sled for next year, some wreaths are hung up there. I think it looks better. That stuff's all going inside. Just going after a little bird. Go get the bird. It's a robin. So uh, I don't know if anybody else has picky kids, but ours is a little bit picky. So we make him. It's from his mom. <laughs> he does not get it from me. It's totally from dad. But we make him smoothies and we put like vegetables in them, hidden with the fruit, and then he'll eat his vegetables, and it works great. If anybody else does that, you guys are brilliant, because I, it works. Like, so Tara, are you calling yourself brilliant? I am brilliant. <laughs> no, I just think it's a good idea. He wants that bird. Did he go on the tree? He's a smart little birdie to run away. Yeah, because who knows what you would do to him. Did you say bye to daddy? Say love we'll you. Bye-bye. We'll say bye-bye, bye bye. grandpa. Bye-bye, I love you. Say have fun. I love you. I love you. Peace, <laughs> peeps. You don't get a sunburn on your hat, huh? I can't believe yeah. he keeps that hat on. Oh, I know. Boy. MJ was very unhappy when Daddy left, and so we called Daddy on the phone, huh? Fire check. Fire check. Sitting on the fire check. That's the spot. Are you talking to daddy? Look at, he has tears. All right, everybody, we're at the airport. On our way to North Carolina for some work. Dad's gonna put me to work. And we're just gonna catch a flight. Here in High Point, North Carolina for work. You can see I'm at the World Furniture Market in High Point. North Carolina. This, all these buildings, this whole city that you see, it goes all the way over to there. It's all devoted to furniture. So every every furniture company or most furniture companies that are, you know, big, they have a, buildings or whole floors of showrooms here that buyers, you know, furniture stores in your local areas come here. They pick the furniture they want, they buy it here, and then ship it to their uh, their locations and sell it to to us and to use. 